What's up guys, Team Hard Life Captain Albert Zertucci. All right, so a few months ago, I started doing the cell lines, but the deal about it was the harnesses and everything were making it real difficult to make it a long-term item. And with me, I'm real picky and, and I do really want to thank my customers that have purchased them and have bared with us through this little turmoil of me trying to find the right item. Well, I did, but it was too slow. Like, it took me 20 minutes to pull in 15 yards. Well, that wasn't gonna work, but I wasn't gonna give up on the project because this housing now is a real strong system that's gonna last them almost indefinitely. And now what we're gonna do, because it's a smaller system, we can step up the game and put a Spectra on there, a hollow core, so that way we can always fix their line and they never have to throw anything away, ever. So it'll be real nice, you know? But because we're stepping up into a Spectra, it means we have a smaller spool. And I'm talking like a six odd size of a spool. So now I'll be able to get all the yardage on there in a smaller, more compact system that's more weather resistant and also too, still has the handle so they can hand crank if the motor ever craps out on them. So it's a win-win, but now, Here's the true test. How long is it gonna take me to actually do this? Right now I got nine yards on there, which ain't much. So I'm gonna start my uh, counter real quick and just knock this out. See how long it takes to get 600 yards back on there. Watch, starting it. Like I said, I got nine yards, which ain't much. But we'll see, it didn't take very much to get up there. Now. See the line counter right there and I'm at 85 yards now and I'm only four and a half minutes into it and I'm still stopping in between there fixing, fixing the, the deal of it moving but now that I got it so I'm going to catch back up on it.
Laten we door, man. Bring me a water, please.
So we're at 600 yards, and I'm going to show you what the inside of the housing looks like so you can see it. That's it right there, and just to give you an idea, that's how big my fingers are, you know, and that's where your braid will go for the cell line. And it took me, oh, let me stop this. It took me about 16 minutes to get it all on there. I would say a little bit less just because I was stopping and having to deal with the issue of the housing moving on the on my cell line setup. It was starting to move up here because of the amount of drag I was still putting on it. But what I also see too is it's good that there's still a lot of space on the side of the housing of the spool. So that way even if they don't get it all nice and pretty there, it will still hold it all on there with no worries. So that's going to be a great improvement. Very compact, all water resistant. And then, look, I was doing it with my battery right there. Very nice. So, oh, now I can disconnect it, and this one's ready to go. Off to the next one.